Dip out and into my zone. Listen closely, what's that sound? Rising up from the underground. Their heads ain't lost, but it ain't been found. Ain't in the habit of sticking around. Ain't in the habit of sticking around. Our cameras on one man. Will he shine against his former club? We're live next, so don't go anywhere. Hello, great to be with you. We're here in Stratford at the London Stadium, a ground built originally for the Olympics in 2012. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's West Ham United versus Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And a look at the West Ham 11. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. A game that should be full of entertaining moments, and it's West Ham United who begin. Ronaldo pressing as a team. Lovro Maia firing it towards goal. Simple save, really. Keira. Play towards the back post. Taking care of business defensively here. And thwarted there following the cross. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. <laughs> Lisandro Martinez. It didn't go according to the Manchester United script in the last game. A draw against Liverpool. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, that one-all draw at home wasn't really the result they wanted. If they can now show similar qualities today against tough opponents, they may just sneak another draw. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? It's looking promising. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Who can he pick out? It hasn't come to very much. 
And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. Not away completely. Angelino. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Well, there's been quite the focus on him coming into today's game. Playing against his old club, and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he shouldn't approach this differently to any other game. He's just got to forget the crowd and go out and play. It's going to be United's free kick. And disappointingly, straight into the wall. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. Well, not cleared away completely. Rice. Well, high and more than a bit hopeful. Perfect tackle. And I'm hearing a change to the scoreline in the Forest match. Here's Alex Scott. It's a goal for Spurs. It's now 1-0 with 16 minutes played. The game has been fascinating so far, Derek. Cheers, Alex. Skamaka. Paqueta. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Can he find the right pass? Well, just the tackle that was needed. Getting in there to intercept. And he's got the beating of his opponent. He's going forward well here. Nicely timed tackle. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. A really intense pressure applied. Well, a powerful effort, but just wide. <laughs> Losing possession. Paqueta. Keira. Well, he's given us away. Odson Edouard. Options in the center. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. This is for Xavier Vicente, travelled here from Spain. Now, Xavier, can you please go back and meet the rest of the party at the ticket office? Downs. Paqueta. And space to cross it. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. For more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. He landed really awkwardly on his shoulder there and is in some discomfort. But he's a tough cookie. I think he'll stay out there. Cheers, Jeff. It's going to be United's free kick. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. 
And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. Squanders the chance for 1-0. Well, that's a big miss. They should be leading now. doing a fine job of protecting the ball the referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace well in truth it could have been more challenging for the goalkeeper well as the stats confirm the game hasn't got going so far and the attacking play from both sides has been really poor but some credit must go to the defenders because they've dominated here today. And over the touchline for what will be a West Ham throw. Tilo Keira. Well read to ease the pressure. Diogo Dallo. Well, news coming through of a penalty in one of the other matches, and Alex Scott can fill us in. Well, it was Spurs that were awarded the penalty, but it was a magnificent save, top corner by the goalkeeper. The score is still Sorry to jump in, it could be on for them here. Can he find the net? Terrific block. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. No problems for Alphonse Ariola. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. It did look on for them, but not to be. Lucas Paqueta. Now with Keira. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Out of play it goes, and it will be a throw-in. Getting in there to intercept. Paqueta. On the ball, Mayer. Crossing opportunity. And he did well to cut it out. Paqueta. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Can someone get on the end of this? Not problematic for the keeper. It's going to be United's free kick. Angelino. Nicely cut out. Opportunity in the wide area. Difficult to stop him. The delivery. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Gets his glove on it. So now a corner. And there goes the whistle. We're at the halfway stage and the two teams cannot be separated. What have you made of United's performance? Well, the hardest thing as a coach is to get both sides of the game right. Today's a great example. They've looked solid defensively, but once again, they haven't posed enough of a threat going forward. It'll be interesting to see. And they kick up. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. A 
And Ronaldo prepared to fire. And saved by the keeper. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, no end product. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. It might still be problematic. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. What can they do from here? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Odson Edouard. Could cross it in here. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Long way out this. And disappointingly, straight into the wall. to be in terms of the cross there goal kick coming up and time for the change now Lovro Meyer Marino and the cross not sufficiently well played in can he finish? The save was a good one. Delivering it. A gift for any goalkeeper. Well, not the best piece of distribution we've ever seen. And that'll be a throw-in. Emerson must take the lead here oh he's been denied and they remain locked together well that's a good save but really he should have scored from there that's a big chance and over comes the corner well as a defender that will sit you down to the ground and a very good challenge Diogo Dallo. Lisandro Martinez. On well, news of a goal in the Chelsea game. Let's find out all about it, shall we? From Alex Scott. It's a goal for Villa. They've pulled one back with 61 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Oh, he's given the ball away. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Emerson. Teammates available. Might jump in front. Oh, chance missed. Nil-nil it remains. Well, chances don't come much better than that. What a miss that is. And they're making a change. It's going to be a story of two substitutes on at the same time for United.
Alessandro Bastoni. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Well, the pass not finding its target. Can he put them in front? Yes, is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. And I'm hearing a change to the scoreline in the Forest match. Here's Alex Scott. It's a third goal for Nottingham Forest. They now lead 3-2 with 68 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. Perfect challenge. Tilo Kera. And he was in the right place to intercept. That'll be a United throw. Into the final 20 minutes. Diogo Dallo. Well, a bad pass it was. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Alex Moreno. And he read it superbly. And in with a real chance. A oh, strong hand on the ball. They're putting it wide from there. A pity, really. Superb block. United pushing to add to the lead. It'll be a corner. Who can they pick out? Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Lovro Maia. Lucas Paqueta. And he's won the ball. No problems for the keeper. Alex Moreno. Now with Paqueta. And giving it away. Well, he could run onto it here. No worries for the keeper. Wasted possession again. Just ten minutes remaining here. Diogo Dallo. Alessandro Bastoni. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Safe pair of hands did his job. And a goal has gone in in the Nottingham Forest match. Alex Scott has all the details. It's a third goal for Spurs. The score's now level. Must be. Vital intervention. No nonsense clearance. Now the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Well, to Alex, apologies for having to interrupt you just then. Just to confirm, Tottenham did score in that match. And they are level now at three goals apiece. How about that for a game?
United doing well to regain possession. Alessandro Bastoni. United might be able to cash in. Rashford in the middle. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, that's the end of that for now. Maxwell Cornet. Here is Zuma. Alex Moreno. He's given it straight to the opposition. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Maxwell Cornet. And the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage. Well, the foul after the previous one and a free kick ensues. Well, a little lucky to get away without a card. Might be his last warning, though. Takes it on! And fine goalkeeping. Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure victory. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, the goalkeeper made it look as though there was no pressure on him whatsoever. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of their performance all told? Well, Jerry, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. A game that should be full of entertaining moments, and it's West Ham United who begin. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And disappointingly, straight into the wall. Well, not cleared away completely. Well, high and more than a bit hopeful. What a powerful effort, but just wide. And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. Squanders the chance for 1-0. Well, that's a big miss. They should be leading now. Can he find the net? Terrific block. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to... And saved by the keeper. The save was a good one. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big... Well, the pass not finding its target. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Superb block. United pushing to add to the lead. It'll be a corner.
Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? It's looking promising. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And Ronaldo prepared to fire. And saved by the keeper. Well, the pass not finding its target. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer, and you have to say it was on the cards.